Sometimes in the middle of the night, I just get that scary feeling. Different from a dream, like there's something in the room with me. And as much as I try, I can't move. If this sounds familiar, know that you're not cursed and most likely you're not being haunted. It could be something called a sleep paralysis demon. REM sleep is when we do most of our dreaming. During REM, the brain tells the spine to limit muscle movement and that prevents us from acting out our dreams and injuring ourselves. But sleep paralysis, or atonia, is a brief and total loss of muscle control during REM sleep. Sleep paralysis is considered a mixed state of consciousness, blending that vivid, dreaming mind with partial awareness of your surroundings. You feel awake, you may even appear awake, but you can't move a muscle. While it can feel a bit different for everyone, most experiences of sleep paralysis include chest pressure hallucinations that feel like you're suffocating or can't breathe, vestibular motor hallucinations that can include out-of-body sensations or flying, and the always terrifying intruder hallucinations. Being unable to move is scary enough, but add to that the thought of another person or thing in your room? Although the exact cause is unknown, many experts believe that this fear when you realize you can't move actually triggers more panic and creates these frightening hallucinations. Different cultures have different explanations, usually involving a vengeful spirit or a curse, but that shadowy, uninvited guest is most commonly known as a sleep demon. The Latin word incubus means a demon that descends upon sleeping persons, proving even in ancient times people struggle to get quality sleep. And with imagery passed down through art and folklore, tales of sleep demons have continued through today and taken many forms. For instance, the Mara in Slavic lore is a goblin-like creature that sits on people sleeping and gives them nightmares. Then there's a witch with long fingernails commonly felt crawling on top of those who fall asleep on their back. In Brazil, this has been called Pisadera, and in Italy, it's known as Pondefeche. In Spain, the Pizzante is a heavy black animal that walks over your chest at night and makes it hard to breathe. Across Egypt and Turkey, the Jinn al Kabuz is a shapeshifter that torments sleepers by sitting on their chests. In Japan, the feeling is called Kana Shibari, meaning bound in metal. And in Nigeria, it's Ogun Oru, or fittingly, nocturnal warfare. And in America, reported alien abductions increased after the 1960s, most describing a strange light, a blurry figure, and the feeling like they couldn't breathe or escape their abductors. Curiously, all took place in the middle of the night while they were sleeping. Different from dreams, these sleep demon hallucinations result from your mind combining vivid dreaming with familiar surroundings. While there is no direct treatment for sleep paralysis demons, most experts recommend you focus instead on any possible underlying issues. Disruptions to REM sleep are often caused by distress to your mental health. Consider if you're struggling with any stress, anxiety, grief, or trauma and seek counseling to address these concerns. If you experience an episode of sleep paralysis, remind yourself that it was only temporary and that demon wasn't real. Remember, the phenomenon was simply a blip of consciousness that happened during sleep. So while these unsettling hallucinations are interpreted differently around the world, just know that if you've ever felt a faceless, shapeless presence in the night, you're not alone. Figuratively. Things like sleep demons can be frightening, but a more general fear of sleeping is called somnophobia. To learn more about that, check out our video. Thanks for watching everyone. Sleep well.